Yeah, guys, right behind me here, you're looking at some of the damage that's left over from hours of work of firefighters working to put out these flames. The smell of smoke is still present in the air, and neighbors say they're still a bit shaken up. More of like, a, like an uh, adrenaline rush. Daniel Jones works across the street from the house. He says he called 911 as soon as he saw the smoke. While talking with first responders, he says two of his co-workers ran inside. Pretty much everybody was sleeping and uh, we rushed, they rushed in and made sure everybody was safe and got out quickly. So Fire crews are still investigating what exactly caused the fire. They say it started on the second or third floor and quickly spread to the attic. At one point, the flames were so hot, firefighters had to stop working and get out of the house. They were soon able to continue working and a couple hours later, the flames were out. I was kind of panicking for everybody inside the building. I just wanted to make sure everybody was safe. Crews say everyone made it out of the house safely. One man was treated for smoke inhalation but was later released from the hospital. In Spokane, Shayna Walltower, Crime 2 News.